all, let's cut the myths and get to the science. As someone who studied microbiology and is a PhD student in biotechnology, I know for a fact that skin color does not matter to the virus. Black people are not immune to the new coronavirus, COVID-19. A Zimbabwean TV journalist, Zororo Makamba, who recently died at the age of 30, should tell you this. Our lungs are the same to the virus and our throats are the same. The virus is a bit of RNA wrapped in protein and again wrapped in a fatty outer shell. It's the outer shell that is part of the virus that recognizes human cells and starts the infection process. So it's very important to destroy that. Luckily, it uses fats and oils to hold itself together. And what destroys oils? Soap. So you must wash your hands properly for 20 seconds or use an alcohol-based sanitizer. It's the alcohol in the sanitizer that destroys the outer shell. The virus survives for a very long time on surfaces like door handles, light switches, as well as the wrappers from the foods that we get from the shop. So make sure that you clean them as an extra precaution. You can clean your food wrappers as well as surfaces with soap and water. The virus has no flippers or wings, so it cannot move by itself. It is people who move it around in our hands as well as when we sneeze and when we cough. So let's not give the virus a chance. Stay at home. Do you have questions about how the virus spreads? Do you have ideas on how we can manage the virus in an African context? Science students, are you playing your part by spreading the word? Humanities students, are you coming up with ideas on how we can manage the disease in our society? Please comment down below if you want me to cover any other topics about the coronavirus and please share this video to spread the word. <laughs>